Now to the attack in Munich, Germany. Police there are giving a cautious all clear tonight after a rampage killed nine people in a crowded shopping mall. Investigators now say tonight they believe that there was only one shooter and he was an 18 year old man who later killed himself. They spent hours searching for other possible gunmen, shutting down that city, leaving thousands of people stranded. Among them, a North Texas woman. And Gilma, you spoke with her by phone tonight. Doug and Kaylee, this business owner from North Richland Hills calls this trip to Germany her bucket list trip. She's always wanted to go there. We spoke with her once she and her family were finally able to return to their hotel room in Munich, safe tonight after a citywide lockdown. Cell phone video captures the terrifying moments outside a Munich McDonald's. A man dressed in black raises his gun. People flee, and then he starts to shoot. There's nobody on the street. North Richland Hills resident Terry Lodick is in Munich on a German vacation she's waited all her life to take. Family was worried because of the down shootings and, and you know, the France uh, problems and and, you know, research, you want to go? And I said, well, you know, it can happen anywhere. She just happened to take a tour away from the city, learning of the shooting on her way back to Munich. Public transportation shut down amid fears more shooters were on the run. They stopped the train and we got off in case these guys got on a train and were heading back out. For hours, the city was on lockdown. Lodick and her family took refuge inside of a pub. They told us to, to just stay inside the buildings and don't leave, don't go outside. They didn't want us to, uh, they didn't want any movement. Everybody inside. They finally made it to their hotel room before 1 a.m. Munich time, ready for bed. Police on alert and at the ready throughout the city. They've got the front door blocked. Nobody's getting in. So I think we're as safe as we can be. Lodic says she and her family were thankfully out of harm's way. Tonight, she was thinking of the people who were not so fortunate. She plans to stay the length of her trip in Germany, but says she's going to remain on alert. Kaylee?